Think about it. Okay? Think about it. Why? Ek bar aur sorry. Think about. The cards are Indian films and shows that attempt to deal with the supernatural usually turn out funny or simply boring. Shudoy Ghosh's new Netflix show Typewriter is a lot of things and has a million points you can pick on. But is it one of those cringy films that have bad graphics? Probably not. A bunch of kids in Goa are on a ghost hunt. They find themselves attracted to a creepy looking mansion called Varda's Villa. A family has moved in here recently and the mother used to live there as a child with her grandfather and mother. Now the entire town knows of the horrors of this house, the murders, the ghost stories and that's what makes up the basis of this story. The show is brilliantly shot for most part. It also unfolds with carefully crafted build-ups that manage to keep your attention. At no point of the show do you actually feel bored or disinterested. Shujoy Ghosh does the brilliant job of adding just the right amount of darkness, mild humor, and gives his characters breathing space which makes them believable. Unlike a lot of shows recently, Typewriter doesn't just throw in aimless stories with no background to show intention. The performances of the actors must be applauded as well. Actor Paula Mugosh does an excellent job. She plays the role of a ghost as well as that of a broken young woman who's haunted by the horrors of her past. Now, the gang of children, they're superb. They play a curiosity and innocence in their eyes, but their controlled display of emotions is commendable. Actor Purab Kohli is excellent as well. He plays a policeman who's investigating the murders, but also the father of one of these children. The warmth he brings to the camera is rare to see. What the show starts off really well, very soon after the first episode, it becomes incredibly predictable. It is as if the writer picked up elements from every horror film ever made and put them into a concoction that otherwise stays well. Think about it. A broken old house, bathroom scenes that culminate into a jump scare, violent men, female ghosts, doors that are haunted, the wait for a particular moon sighting. It's like everything we've seen in every horror film ever made. It's like they didn't even try, you know what I mean? Another problem that sticks out in the show are the unnecessary subplots. Actors like Ellie Avram and Samir Kocher, the characters add nothing to the show. It's like every time they're on screen, it makes you want to skip ahead. It's like the writer wanted to make a tangled mess just so in the end he could untangle it. But as an audience, you find yourself asking, why are you doing this? In the end, the conclusion kind of makes you go meh. The build-ups amount to nothing. At one point of the show, Palomi Ghosh is staring at the ghost who looks exactly like her and everybody is calm like it's a family gathering. All said and done, Typewriter is a great one-time watch for a friend's night in. But if you're looking for groundbreaking work from Shujoy Ghosh who has helped films like Kahani and Badla, this is probably not the place for you to be.